Yep, hey guys, Drake, we're here today, and we're back with Stranger Things episode 5. We left off basically with Dart fucking eating a cat, mate. That was fucking brutal. And then, like, Harper and Eleven's situation is falling to pieces a bit, their relationship. Hopefully, they can build it back up soon as they're both being stubborn. I think Harper was a bit too harsh. Like, he's a grown up in the situation. There's no need for him to say some of the things he said. Especially because, on top of that, he's lying, he's, keep he's keeping it locked up keeps promising that he's going to let it go for free soon and he's not really doing it to be fair with this the hawk laboratory whereas nancy and nancy and jonathan are taking that into their hands to deal with them they should be gone i don't know why they let the hawk the hawk laboratory stay because they're not cleaning it up they're cleaning it up in their base but then it's spread underground which we learned last episode but over that it's been a solid episode and looking forward to see more of it i'm gonna be doing two episodes today so hopefully we get through this um but yeah no um I look forward to watching this, guys. So if you enjoy this content, please leave a like, subscribe. It helps massively. And obviously subscribe because Season 3 is coming out soon. I'll be reacting to that. So let's get into this. I love how the mom's always figuring out stuff. Like, normally Kip parents quite useless characters, but she does fucking gr grind. She gets the job done. Will can't catch a break, can he? He just keeps getting in more shit. What the fuck did you just spit at him, mate? What the fuck is that shit? Mate, I don't look like a satisfying spot popping. And they've trapped them down there, just great. I was getting out of that one. Why are people in motels are really shit at the job? Oh yeah, they cut the hand, didn't they? They soul bonded. The chemistry, oh bless. Look after his brother, weren't he? Alright, so she did give Jonathan time to post with Steve, but then she waited a month to get with someone because she got lonely, clearly. And obviously dealing with all that by herself is not an easy thing to deal with. And Jonathan wasn't there. But he did. I can understand Jonathan's point of view that he needs to look after Will, so... That makes sense. I'm glad they mentioned that, because that was a bit weird why she went straight back with Will Steve. But of course, she's nice she's going to get back with Steve, but she needs to be with someone. And especially with like Barb dying, I think you know and she can't share any of it. I don't see Hopper dying. You already scared me last season. I believe the guy can get through anything. Oh, it's fine. Put some around his mouth. Thank you. He's got girl problems. You need to stop doing that. Fuck now. Is Luca's going to be Max's love interested. Interesting. Guess he doesn't need something to do with his character. Dustin's got dark. Oh yeah, your cat's been murdered. This poor mum. Gonna be looking for that cat forever. What's your shit cat instincts that got yourself killed that easily? <laughs> Warrior. You can take on anything. Oh, hot dog's so cute. So deadly though. Oh. Oh, dog. I feel really bad for it. You ate my cat. You dog. Why well, do I feel really bad for dog? Even though it murdered his cat. <laughs> Still, poor dog. Yeah, <laughs> she looks terrified. <laughs> oh, I actually looked. Oh, this guy, the communist guy. <laughs> Why would you trust this guy? Her name was Eleven. <laughs> Why are you reading this conspiracy theory, mate? I guess the more people you get to know, though, if you got killed or you can pass it on. 
Oh, is he doing a favor for Lucas? Obviously. Lucas is waiting to meet you. Oh, he's just going to tell him everything. Mate, you're just about to get fucking one season in one one minute. Recap time, everybody. <laughs> I wonder what he's going to think if he sees this. I feel like if anyone's going to die this season, he's going to be one of them. Of Such a nice guy, though. He looks so happy. Because <laughs> Bob's smart, so he can figure it out. Okay. <laughs> Bob's getting stressed, mate. Come on, Bob. I believe in you. You went to Mordor and back. You can figure this out easy. Mate, what a legend. Fucking, mate, what a G. Oh, he's going to die this season. I feel like he's going to help out and get murdered. I like him as well. I just feel they don't have plot armor like everyone else. Oh, because it hates water. So obviously, the monster doesn't like water. That's going to be the big thing. Here. Mate, you caused this problem by not yeah. giving him up. Oh, yeah, but they came out the start of this series. It's showing like a female with powers as well. Mate, when Bob's coming in to be the MVP of the show. <laughs> Dad, <laughs> still the best character. Just a ledge. Oh, he moves really. He moves so slow. It's glorious. <laughs> That's why he's the best character, mate. <laughs> I love Ted. <laughs> He lives the glorious life. That looks very uncomfortably tight. Get out. Hope he just locked him up like it did to Will. <laughs> Mate, he's just like, my conspiracy theory was right. <laughs> the books I can write. I can agree with that. That's what I use my vodka for. Man's got a fine taste. I like it. Let him enjoy his vodka, guys. We water it down. Precisely. Wait, what story? <laughs> I love that as a comfortable conclusion. Vodka does help. <laughs> Jonathan's just like, yeah, I think so. <laughs> I agree. What was that about? Why is the mum scary? I'm scared. Right. We get a bit of a flashback. Mate, you just took a baby just like that. All the safe. So we got the safe. Hey, this is an interesting flashback. I'm liking it. Oh, she went to Hawkins. Mate, how many kids did they keep? They just send her crazy then. Mate. Just fire brain. Fucking hell. Oh, so she remembers very certain things. Okay. Oh, was the other child the one from the beginning of the show? Because um, 
Yeah, it must be. She's one from the start of the season. Okay, that's interesting. So we know who the other child is then. So she grew up with 11. It was in that facility. Joyce is a fucking warrior. She just fucking goes in. Sam, don't go down. It's got a high chance of you dying. If you... Bob, don't go down. I feel bad. Bob's going to die. Oh, no, don't go down, Sam. Mate, Sam's gonna die. No! I've just got that, you know, I feel it when you know because of character. Mate, Bob the hero. He's fucking looking. Mate, Bob's saving this team. Mate, they just came in time. <laughs> got, got his hat, man. But the government actually come to help for a change. the fuck? That's terrifying. Mate, is that connected to it? <sighs> that was an intense ending. Yeah, because I'm jumping straight into the next one, guys. I'm just going to wrap it up quickly and just place it. That was a really good episode. We've learnt so much. Oh, I feel like it's nice when you feel like the show's got progression going. I definitely have loads of an episode. It's so interesting with Hopper. I'm still weary about Bob dying. I feel like they haven't killed anyone big in this uh, this season yet, and I feel like Bob's the most likely candidate. Learn loads about the mum. Man, I feel bad for they fry the brain to the point she only remembered certain things in the codes, which is the code, the rainbow. We also seen the other child, what's got S that, that S got that like, telekinesis powers because she's the one from the start of the episode, so I wonder when they're gonna introduce her. Is she just a bit of a build up until season three or is she gonna be in this season? More than that, fantastic episode guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this reaction. Hope to see you next week. Well, tomorrow and peace.